Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when Windows 11 version 2.5 H2 is not showing in Windows update section. So if you don't see Windows 11 version 2.5 H2 to install over here, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Over here you can see Windows 11 installation assistant. Uh, you can click on download now and then run the CXE file. Click on yes to allow and over here you will see download option to update your Windows 11 to version 25H2. In my case, it's already up to date. Now, if you when you run this Windows 11 installation assistant over here, it might somewhere over here, you will see blue hyperlink to run PC health. Here you can see uh, you might it might tell you to install this Windows PC health check setup. So in blue hyperlink it would be there over here so you can install it and then run it it will check if the windows 11 your computer is compatible with 25h2 or not once you run it now you will see refresh option over here so you can you can click on refresh over here and then you will see an option to update and once you see that it will go through number of updates there will be a couple of updates so in my case i already did it so there will be a couple of updates so you can download it let the download complete once done once this is complete then restart your computer and after the system restart you should be able to see your windows 11 updated to version 25h2 still not working in that case you can go to the same website and then on this website again scroll down click on media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file now when you run this exe file uh, you will see accept option so click on accept over here and by default windows 11 will be selected and then click on next over here select iso file over here and then click on next and then you can save it to desktop save and then let the download complete this process will take some time and once done click on finish option once you hit finish let it close automatically do not close this manually it will take few seconds to close once closed now you can go to desktop make a double click on windows iso file and then make a double click on setup file run this setup file click on yes to allow and then click on next over here accept and then here you can see ready to install by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so make sure this is checked and then click on install after the installation uh, you can try to update you can check you should be able to update your windows 11 to version 25h2 so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel